What's going on, people? It's your friendly neighborhood, man. You already know what it is. This is the first episode of Talk To Me Nice. Well, we have personal one-on-one -on -one conversations. Well, we have conversation to be me and whomever watching this. So, stay tuned. Talk To Me Nice. talk about learning how to be alone because there's a lot of y'all out there that don't know how to be alone y'all always need somebody in your life y'all always need somebody up under you because you don't know how to be alone you're too afraid to be alone don't worry k got you we here learn how to be alone my bad i just i just came from somewhere don't worry about all that but we back to it listen being alone is not bad. It's actually good for you. You know why? Because you de detoxify yourself from motherfuckers that be around you that just want to eat off your plate that ain't really bringing nothing to the table. It's cool. Learn how to be by yourself. I love being by myself. You know why? Because I ain't got to answer to nobody. I ain't got to talk to nobody. I can do what I want to do. Why? Because I know how to be alone. I don't get scared of being alone. I don't need people up under me 24-7. I don't need friends around me. Every time you see Cage in that Casper, I'm by myself. You know why? Because I know how to be alone. Learn how to be alone. Some of y'all need it. Can y'all see me? I'm hiding. Y'all probably can see me, huh? Anyway, that's besides the point. Listen, a lot of y'all need somebody around y'all to make you feel good about yourself. That's why you jump in and out of relationships. You jump from friend to friend. You know why? Because you don't know how to be alone. Every time you jump into a relationship, you always say, it was worse than the last one that you was just in. You know why? Because you haven't given yourself to heal from the last relationship that you was in. You didn't give yourself enough time to heal and build and be by yourself and learn how to love yourself. So what you try to do is get fabricated love from other people, from friends, from family. And yes, family can be toxic and you sometimes have to detoxify yourself from your family. You have to detoxify yourself from friends who ain't doing nothing for you. And all the time, you got those friends that want to see you drown and want to see you go down, always bringing you drama. See, you need to get away from those. See, my friends know, don't come to me with the bullshit because I don't want to hear. I don't care who fucking who. I don't care who talking to who. I don't care who drive what. I'm in my own lane, driving down my own road. Get in your lane, you can drive beside me, and we can get there. But don't turn your blinkers on and try to get in my lane, because uh, I run your ass off the road. See, listen. I know y'all ain't think I can do that, but listen. Let me put my glasses on. And my hat. So understand what I'm trying to say to y'all. That being alone, it ain't a bad thing. You get time to grow. You get time to prosper. You get time to handle shit that you can normally handle because you always got somebody around you. You understand what I'm saying? You get time to breathe. You get time to meditate. You get time to sage your house. Do things that you love to do instead when you couldn't do it because you had toxic people around you. You understand? Sometimes you gotta tell motherfuckers, you know, you gotta test motherfuckers. You gotta be like, I'm about to go and sit on top of my roof, look at the stars and meditate. If they hit you with that, nigga, what? Boop, that means it's time for him to go. Cause they don't understand that your mind has elevated to another level. Not everybody gonna understand that. Not everybody gonna understand your elevation. Elevate yourself. See, I'm about that. I'm about elevating myself. I'm about being around like-minded people. You understand me? I'm not the one that be in the club every weekend with the same clothes on, seeing the same people every weekend. And see, I ain't got time for that. Because one thing I, I learned a long time ago, black folk, alcohol, don't mix. You're not going to catch me in the club all the time. Well, shit, you rarely going to catch me anywhere. You feel me? Because I'm always ducked off. I got to be ducked off. You know why? Because I enjoy my peace of mind. I enjoy my peace. And ain't nobody going to mess up my peace. So, if you toxic, or if you got toxicity around you, what did the doctor tell you? You got to detoxify. The same thing goes on in life. You got to get rid of them friends that's toxifying your life. And once you do that, that monkey will fall off your back. 
You know what I'm saying? The weight will start dropping. You start getting summertime fine. What are y'all females saying nowadays? Uh, 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 hot girl summer. Well, you could do that when you get rid of the motherfuckers that ain't doing nothing for you. You can do that when you get rid of them relationships that ain't going nowhere. You understand me? You've been dating a nigga for 17 years and he ain't popped the question yet. It's time to get out of that. It's time to detoxify yourself, man. It's Cage. Talk to me nice. Gone. What's up, Cage Samus? It's your friend in the neighborhood, homie Cage, man. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. New content is on the way. You can also follow me on my other social medias, man. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Also follow me on Snapchat, man. We here with it. Follow me, follow me, follow me. I promise you I'm trying to put out the best content I possibly can to make you laugh and make you think. You feel what I'm saying? It's Cage. Gone. Be your man, let me hold you down. I put a smile on your face, we gon' never frown. I'll get to this cash, let me teach you how. I know you're tired of playing game with these glass clouds. Let me be your man, let me hold you down. I put a smile on your face, we gon' never frown.